Hey guys, how's it going? It's Thomas, and today I'm bringing you guys another Destiny video. And in this video, we're going to be talking about the Ace of Spades, which is an exotic hand cannon exclusive to the Hunter. So, I'm going to show you guys how to grab this beautiful hand cannon. So, what you have to do first, guys, you have to get your gunsmith to rank 3. And once you do that, he's going to give you this quest right here called Back in the Saddle. So, the first step to this quest is that you have to get hand cannon kills with a primary telemetry consumable active uh, there's a couple ways you can get these consumables you can buy them from the gunsmith or you can just dismantle hand cannons like I am doing right here and you'll get you'll get it from that it's very easy so all I did to complete this guys I just went into a patrol I just went and activated my telemetry and I went around and killed the enemies that spawned it's really really easy guys these these um, exclusive weapons are really easy to get guys and they are pretty good so I would encourage you guys to go out and grab these guns so after you do that guys you get the final couple kills you have to go back to Banshee and have a nice chat with him so he's going to give you the next step and the next step is really easy guys so for this next step just like the other ones you have to dismantle uh, rare or legendary hand cannons so what you can do guys you can just jump into your vault Grab some unwanted hand cannons, dismantle two of them. Uh, if they're legendary, all you need is two. So that's really good. What I did, I just went into my um, inventory, grabbed some shitty hand cannons that I didn't really want, and I just dismantled them and completed the quest. So, for the last step, guys, you just have to go back to Banshee and talk to him once again, and he's going to have this beautiful hand cannon waiting for you. So, there you go, guys. It's really easy to grab this hand cannon, and it is actually a really good gun. I encourage all of you guys to go after this weapon. So, how about we take a closer look at the Ace of Spades. Hey guys, we're back in the tower. Now let's take a closer look at the Ace of Spades. Okay, so its description reads, Don't play your hand unless you're sure you have that Ace in the hole. I'm not too sure what that really means, but that's pretty cool. Okay. So we have 280 attack. You can always infuse it to get it higher. There's no problem there. Uh, now let's take a look at its stats. So as you see, impact is where this gun really shines. The other areas aren't too great, but this gun has great impact. Uh, but looking at these stats, to me, they don't look that great, but this gun is actually really good. I must admit, I really like this gun. This gun and the Hawkwind are probably my favorite hand cannons at the moment. So, what makes this gun so good is its perk right here. Third Eye. It has Third Eye permanently um, active. So, that's really good. So, if you don't know what Third Eye does, Raider stays active while aiming down this weapon sights. This perk is freaking amazing. And now, its sights. Um, the last one is probably the best because you get... A bit of an increase in stability. The other, the other ones aren't really anything special, to be honest. Then we have Firefly. So precision kills with this weapon cause the target to explode. So that's pretty cool. Then we have high caliber rounds, oversized rounds built to stagger targets and leave them reeling. Their mass makes makes a weapon harder to handle. Uh, this weapon has extremely re low recoil. This one is a must. Definitely grab this because this gun does bounce around a little bit. Then we have reinforced barrel, so increased range, reduced stability. I think out of these three, this one is probably the best because stability is, stability is amazing. Come on, guys. Then we have Maverick. Precision kills. Move one round from your ammo reserve into the magazine. So that's pretty cool, guys. You get an extra shot after you get a precision kill. So that's pretty damn sweet. What I think about this hand cannon is that it is an amazing hand cannon. I really like it. I like the way it looks, I like the way it feels, I like the perks it has, and um, I want to get it fully maxed out with some better attack, and um, after that I think this, this hand cannon is going to be fucking amazing. So I'm just going to show you guys a couple crucible clips, and I'll show you a little bonus clip at the end of some of my Nightfall rewards, which were completely terrible. So yeah guys, I'm just going to leave you with that. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. And um, I will see you guys in my next video. And um, also guys, 
please leave some feedback in the comment section so I can make my videos better and more enjoyable.